Hey guys, what's up? It's Rexus, and we're back in our Let's Play Elysium Remastered series, where we only use stab scrolls, spells, and robes on Master Difficulty. Um, last time, we had cleared Forgotten Lore. We had actually gotten Olivia's staff, which I forgot to look at, and it's pretty freaking awesome. Where it's a wall of fire, so it's basically a fire spray, firewall staff, so that'll come in handy. Um, I came here to Farangar because I had quite a bit of gold after that quest, and I bought some spells here. Um, so the thought process, we have Azura's Wrath for if we're up close and I can see that they're almost dead and I need this 57 damage, boom, that's half my magicka. Um, Azura's Reconstruction, I can heal my tanks, my Frost Atronox. Um, let's see here, at least I think I can. A damage Conjured Minion, I should be able to. I got Flame Atronox also just for the fact that double tank isn't always the best I mean yeah it's pretty freaking awesome but I'm gonna experiment as well for if I need to kill quickly pretty much I can use these guys and uh, I got a lot of spells about buffing them up I could got consuming power it gets 75% extra attack damage for 11 seconds and dies um, drop zone for some versatility kind of jack of all trades where I can jump at the target location and not take fall damage if needed uh, ease burden burden for increased carrying capacity this one actually is pretty interesting. Uh, summoned her reanimated minions near the caster, recover five points of health and stamina per second. I assume that's not draining it from me. If not, that's pretty freaking powerful. Um, and I, I just picked up Frostbite earlier, but I never learned it because I probably will never use it. But I distinctly remember there's a quest, I believe, in the Dragonborn DLC where you need this spell, so I'm going to hold on to it. Also, this was kind of pricey, but I got uh, Gonar's Greed. Transfers all items from dead bodies within a 60 foot radius to the caster. Can be especially useful if I kill something and don't know where it is. But I know I killed it, so. And then Octo... or... Oct... Octo's Recital. I don't know why I was like, oh, God. Octo's Recital. So, I don't have enough spells yet, I don't think, for that to be useful. But um, that's one of the really powerful spells in the game. And uh, let's see. Power of the Master. Cast a beneficial self-targeting spell in your left hand. All nearby summon a reanimated teacher creatures. I don't know. I don't think I can do that. If I could, that's going to be cool. But if not, you know, like Oak Flesh and stuff like that. So let's go ahead and learn these. And I leveled up a couple times, too, just due to all the books that I had looted at the uh, college. So I got to thinking, let's see, non-elemental. I don't know many non-elemental, but eventually I'm going to end up taking all these perks anyway. But uh, I'm going to take that. I don't... Actually, I am going to take this. And the reason to do it, I'm pretty sure that my Frost Atronox, like, damage might go up. I read that somewhere. I don't know if it's true or not. And I have an idea in Restoration that's going to be broken with like a summoner build. Harm. Wild Healing. If if it is in the game, I, th I think it is. If it is, that's going to be broken. Um, I'll basically be able to heal my stuff and damage enemies while I'm doing it. So, uh, And then, yeah. It's going to be cool. Um, let's see here. Let's take a perk and alteration as well, since I am starting to kind of get some more stuff in there. And with all that being said, we are in Dragon's Reach, so I think that while we're waiting on Olivia to put that together, we might as well do the interesting prospect. If it's still not done, then we can try hitting the books again. Um, well, y'all didn't see it. I tried it off screen, and it was just ridiculously difficult. So, um... Let's see. Silent Moon's camp is close. So I know that we can go to Mark Hearth and do that. There's Silent Moon's camp, and here I am. So we'll probably hit up Silent Moon's camp first. And then we'll go from there. Where's the other one? Am I overlooking it? Chamber of Someone in the Reach. Broken Helm Hollow. Oh, that's all the way over here in, like, Riften. Okay. All right. Well, I'm going to fast travel out here, and we are going to go to Silent Moon's camp. Can't fast travel from here. I'll see y'all in a second. This is storming. My goodness. 
might wait just for my frame rate. Let's see. Let's wait just a minute. This goes away. There we go. And now I want it to be morning. <laughs> I love the faster waiting. That's like, that should be in the game by default. But alas, it is not. Um, I haven't really set up this stuff here, so I'm thinking I'll probably oh, I'll need to go in here first. So drop zone. I mean, we'll go ahead and favorite this stuff. I, and again, I don't think that I can use Octo's recital yet. I do want to favorite that. That's pretty good. Um, yeah, these are the ones I wanted to play with here. Okay, so. Instead of Conjure Avenging Wraith, we're going to do the Flame Atronach. Instead of the Bone Spirit, currently, I will do... Consuming Power. Instead of... Let's see, I want to leave that the way it is. Instead of the Frost Rune, we'll do this. And we'll do seven as power from the master. Which I'm trying to remember what power the master does. I think it's like, uh, yeah, self beneficial. So we probably won't be doing that as much. Let's see. Let's see if this even works. Here, what is this? Actually. Well, no, I might as well. I might as well. Here. Here's an extra one. Okay. And let's see. Here's this. Oh, so it's just a continuous cast. I see, I see. Uh, let's see. Third is Firebolt. Two is this thing. Or I can make it really mad and hit really hard. So easy is one, two. <laughs> right on. You know, and again, I wasn't really planning on doing like a Conjurer build, but that's just kind of how it happens. Ready. Sweet experience. Man, absolutely beautiful. I know I say that every video. Can't help it though. Well, there's our target. I'm going to pick the Nern Root because of invisibility potions. That's helpful. Let's see. Yeah, but I think a summoner build actually will work out extremely well. Okay. I'm gonna drop another one because I know that there's bandits here. And I don't know why that keeps auto saving. Like, I keep turning this off. Like, repeatedly. Yeah, it's off. Stay off. I don't know why that's doing that. Well, there's a person over here, so let's, uh... Ooh, can I get a Alright, here we go. Did that work on that? I don't know if it did or not. Nope. Oh, oh, shoot. Hold on, I need extra magicka, more magicka, minor healing, generation, and let's do this here. Common. Common. Perfect, perfect, perfect. with my summons right now. What is with my summons? Oh! Oh, I can. For a second, I thought I couldn't. Kill it. Kill it. Yeah. 
come at me. Anybody? Anybody else? That is gorgeous. Alright. There's one more. I can sense it. Where are they, though? You can't hide. I mean, there's really no point in hiding. Ah. Uh, ah, I see. Okay. I want to have fun with you. Where, oh where, did you go? Hello? I know that there's people over here. Yeah. You know, I don't know why that's doing that, but... They're fighting something. Okay, I'm gonna open this. Ah, uh, yes. Nope. Come on. Ow. Ow! No, 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 no. Get up, get up. You're alive. And you're gonna stay alive. I wish I'd done that instead. That gummit. That gummit. Yes. Oh my god. Oh, okay. I may have talked a little bit of smack. I didn't mean to do that. Why isn't my thing like there we go? Okay. Maybe this playthrough will be like more or, or like You know what I'm saying. Not one handed. Did we win? Yes, Lucian. We won. Alright, I wanna try this new spell here. I wanna say it before I do. <laughs> I'm carrying literally too much of it around. <laughs> That's pretty sick, though. Here, I'll see you in just a second. Lucian Flavius reporting for duty. <laughs> That's a did cool, nifty little spell. Or did the I like that. Might choose that. All right. I hear some more people. Let's go ahead and do this. Hopefully this isn't too dark on YouTube. The atmosphere in-game is actually incredible. So hopefully it carries that fill. Hmm. Yo. Back up, back up. <laughs> We're still on Master, right? Like, I mean, yeah, yeah. I should have just been playing a mage the entire time. I knew that this was going to happen to an extent. I knew that eventually I would be pretty beefy. Or at least be able to put out damage. Because that's what a mage is all about. kind of lackluster. Alright. Let's go back out here. We'll drop a save, go inside, clear this place, and that'll be one item down. Okay. I know from past playthroughs. Is someone there? Yep. Oh, you're invisible. Alright. Oh, crap. Insufficient charge. That's the one bad thing. Kill it. Actually, I tell you what. Yeah. Oh my god! Okay. Don't get close. Noted. <laughs> okay. 
I don't think you're gonna get as lucky two times in a row. Go, my minions. I still can't believe that, uh... This doesn't work. Maybe it does. Her. Guys. Guys, come on. Here, change plans. We need sleeker. One of you would be just crazy. Attack her. Kill her. Alright, well, that was a different way to deal with it, but I'll take it. Now, just because it says it's cleared, I've noticed that on some... You hear that? We're not really cleared. I'm not sure what causes that. I don't know if it's the fact of, like, uh... That, like, on the vanilla, that's kind of... What was... Like, the default that you needed to kill for it to be cleared, or what? Okay. I think that this actually. Someone oh, there. well, crap. Nope. No one's here. Is there anyone here? You know what? Both of you. Did you get it? Mmm. The A and B looks good. Alright. Wait, do I have Iron Claws yet? Don't. And they're relatively light. I don't know if I'll be able to get them though. It's times like this where I wish that I had like a weakened lock spell. And I know that they have it. Dead gummit. Okay. Alright. Let's go ahead and do this. Excavation site. And I might end up giving some of this stuff to Lucian. Because that is actually what I had done to begin with. But. That's beautiful. Den Stagmer's Ring. Now, this ring. It's much. Oh my gosh. Yeah. I mean, look at this. I have resist from the boots already. So that's 55% resistance to pretty much all like destruction magic. It must take a lot of bad stuff to drive a person to banditry. What's new? Right. Go ahead. Load me up. Oh, I will. As much as I can at least. Um uh, that. Oh, see, we're already <laughs> we're already there. Um can have this. Okay. What's next? That's what I'm most excited for with Legacy of the Dragonborn, is just like literally just beefing Lucian up. The only problem is I don't know how to like force equip items. Um, I know that there was something on YouTube or something along those lines that basically was like, uh, hold on. Oh, oh, it cannot be picked. Alright, what was this? Wait, hold on, hold on. I know I'm missing something from past playthroughs. Uh, first off, there. Where is it? Hmm. I know that there's like a book or something around here. This, yeah. Malrus's journal. I already took it. Take that. Okay. I don't know if I mentioned earlier, but the way that I leveled up twice was basically just, just walking around discovering stuff in the college and picking up like a hundred books. <laughs> uh, let's see. Journal. Mowers's. This. There's that. I've read it before. Basically, it's like marked places where you can go. Um, 
And I really didn't use it in my last playthrough. Um, I might remedy that this time, since I basically... Oh, that scared the crap out of me. I was like, this is it. Yeah. But yeah, since I'm like limited in what I can actually do. But yet I have all the power. <laughs> Oh my gosh. What the frick, dude? I wasn't even ready. What is going on? Okay. Where do these people come from? Like, seriously. I can't tell who's who. Oh, well, that's not Lucy. I know that. Oh my god! This isn't good. Uh, okay, let's let's think this through, right? Health is increased by 60. Yep. Regeneration. Yep. Let's see. Yep. Let's go. Um, and let's actually do some of this to... Oh my god, leave me alone. Leave me alone. Dang. Oh. Oh. We in it sickly? Die, fucking. No. Okay. Let's try this again. <laughs> More health and match resistance. Okay, let's try this again. Not gonna cheese me this time. What? Are you serious? Oh my gosh. Okay, well, that was a dream. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, it was not a dream. Indeed, was, can confirm, it was not a dream. Kill them all. different this time, huh? Alright. I will... Let's see, where are we going next? We got the Reach, and we have up here. Oh, no. Actually, we have Rift, and... So we haven't been to Rift yet. I think I'm gonna go over here. Which Markarth would be the closest place. So I'll see y'all when we get to Markarth. Man, the reach is freaking beautiful. I love it. I absolutely love it. it sure, it's foggy though in the distance. It's the one bad thing about staffs, man. It's just like you look up and it's just like, oh. Well, our build isn't invincible, as you saw. So, master difficulty it is, but when it works, it works. <laughs> And I'm excited to get that healing perk, because that literally, you can be healed from that. Like me. I can be healed from that. And it can damage an enemy or one of my uh, minions or companions. Like, it's, it's freaking awesome. Who is this? What are y'all doing? Need something? Uh. Nah, I don't think so. What about you? Mm -hmm. Nah, I don't think so. Let me guess. Mm -hmm. Nah, I don't think so. Alright, whatever. Forget you, I don't want to help you anyway. Okay, so this should be like the Jade Warrior 2, I, I believe. And I also think this is like a Force Warden camp. Yeah, something like that. So, let's drop a save. And let's actually let's just go ahead and do it this way. Be free. Dodge. If 
fire for everyone. I really don't want it to end now. I don't need it to. Back up, Clam. Alright, Lucian, you good? I'm pretty sure these are all museum items as well. I just really don't have the room for them. You look Sorry, I awful. keep meaning to give you this. Since this arrangement seems to be working out all right for us so far. <laughs> Covered in blood, almost half dead. What is it? Oh, it's a Dwemer resonance sphere. Just something my father gave to me before I left home for when I found myself someone to travel with. When activated, it resonates with its twin, which I'll always keep on my person. That way, if we're ever separated, all you have to do is give us a rub, and we'll be able to find each other, no matter how far apart we are. See, that's what I was referencing the last time Handy, about right? Lucian. Very, thanks. Don't mention it. I mean, hopefully we won't have to use it very often. I'll stick to you like a... Like a... Oh, I don't know. Something sticky. Yep. Well, that's what I'll do. Okay. Fruit. Tape. Glue. Child's hands. Okay. <laughs> uh, actually, I need... To, I'm gonna trade with Lucian real quick, guys. What's new? Uh, what a coincidence. I need to trade some things with you, too. Do you? Okay, let's see. Let's just sort by weight. And I can't use any of this stuff anyway. And that way we give him everything that we can give him. Okay, I think that's all we can give Let's him. get moving. Pretty sure that's everybody. Was there someone? No? I mean, I could use Gondar's Greed just to make sure we didn't miss anything, but... There it is. Jade Warrior number two. Do you mind? Oh, dude, I'm about to... I don't even know Fusor at all, and I'm about to use it. Let's see. I can take that. That's cheap. What is that? That's something. Ah. Something else that I do not need. Alright, where's our next objective? It's in Riften, so I will see you guys. We'll go from this beautiful environment to another beautiful environment. All right, we are in the gorgeous rift near Riften. So I will see you guys when we get closer to our destination. You know, I've been thinking uh, those loading screens that I've added, they're absolutely gorgeous for one, but two, they're full of lore. And uh, a lot of them are like show a picture of someone like a loading screen and it'll be like, this was so-and-so. Like one of them was like, this is this one guy and he was a, uh, I don't know. But anyway, he was a high elf, and he was called, like, the Culling, because he literally wanted to, like, basically yeah, do enough. oblivion to, like, everything. So, um, let's try this here. But yeah, I mean, it inspires me for, like, focused character builds and such. Go, get another hit in. Oh, it's, a. Uh, one of those. Get him, Lucian. <laughs> Only in Skyrim can you sound like an anime character and it sound cool. What in the world? Lucian? Hi! <laughs> Let me know if you need anything else. <laughs> Uh, let's see. Ooh, a chest. An apprentice chest. Is lock overhauled? Hold on. I gotta, I gotta look at this. Because this could change everything. Uh, MCM. Lock overhaul. Set installed. Alphabet? Nope. Okay. 
I won't be adding it either. I, I really don't want to add many mods, if any, to this playlist. At least on this playthrough. I want to get Elysium for what it is. You know what I mean? The beautiful, hard, challenging, yet fair, rewarding, just awesome on this. I love it. Yeah, but it, back to the loading screens. I want to like build like focus builds and stuff. So that guy, the Colin, he basically was wanting to do the Oblivion Crisis, but like not May Room Stiglon, but him. And like it just, it was legit, and it showed like this high elf and like an Oblivion Gate behind him, like open. It was cool. All right, we are practically here. It's just getting there. Crap. Hopefully, I don't die because I've not saved in a minute. Crap. Double crap. That's right. You know what? I think it's okay to so go ahead. Whoops. Oh, if I can hit you. Hold still. Quit dancing. Oh god. Well, that worked out horribly. Um, that's what the staff is for. Honestly, that's exactly what the staff is for. Get him, Lucy. Perfect. We'd be a rubbish bandit. Much too polite. <laughs> If I recall the last time I was here, like in the original Elysium playthrough with my warrior, this place was like insanely hard, like, I don't know if I could do it at first, because I remember they're like off to the left, um, let's see, am I even hitting T, am I crazy, no, I'm not crazy, um, okay, ooh, you know what, maybe fireballs. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and save. We're gonna head on in here and get our third and final item, I think. Yeah. Okay, let's go, guys. Uh, yeah, I'm here. Oh, don't get up on my account. No way, here we go. And that's how we do that. Everything as a mage seems easier, like in a way. Like I, I have more options to be able to like juggle a lot of en enemies and words, <laughs> enemies and, and enemies. Uh, take the potion lock picking because I can actually somewhat use it. All right, another card of woo. All right, well, that scared me. Um, Lesser Soul Gem. Don't mind if I do. I'll take the dagger since I apparently don't have one yet. Let's see. Make sure. Ooh, almost missed that. That'll be worth a pretty penny. But why we came? The Sixth House Bell Hammer. down here. Is there another bandit? No, but there's a dead body. I can sell that poison. Um, Unbound fire. Bolt of wildfire that deals 13 damage. The flame randomly jumps to the target or the caster. See? I, I don't... I don't like that. I'll take it to sell, but I, I don't like that. I don't, in any circumstance, see where that is useful. 
Where's this guy? Oh, well, he's right here. There you go. He did. <laughs> All right, so let's go back to the Legacy of the Dragonborn. Turn this in. Turn everything else in that we're able to. Actually, we'll take these still claws and stuff because I can actually turn it in the museum. I will see you guys when we are back in Riften. We are back. Good day. I found the Jade Warrior number two. Oh, you have? Excellent. Yes, I have just the place for this. Thank you. Here's your reward. I found the six tiles bell hammer. Ah, phenomenal. Let me have a look. Ah, yes. Exactly as described. Good work. And I found your pay. Din Stagmer's ring, although I'm going to retrieve it. Very good. And in excellent condition, it seems. That is very impressive, my friend. Which brings me to my next proposal. I'm in need a person of your caliber who can dedicate themselves to uncovering more lost artifacts and relics on their own while I continue my research efforts. And you have proven yourself more than capable of the job. And I think a special arrangement could work. Instead of me simply buying the relics off of you, perhaps you could bring them here, lend them to the museum. I'll give you an occasional finder's fee, and we'll safeguard your collection for you. You'll be able to access any and all of your collection as you see fit, and you'll need the rest of it will be safe in your absence. Sounds great to me. Excellent. Well, let me give you the ten septum tour then. This building was once called Magnarian Hall and was built as a temple dedicated to Talos, the patron god of the Lord. Oh, what? It, however, oh, the achievement. Cut the ribbon. The <laughs> <laughs> I came here a few years ago well, and was able to procure use of the space in the pursuit of establishing this museum. Of course, I have had the building vastly expanded over the last two years okay. to accommodate what I hope will become one of the grandest collections of Tanrielic history in the world. All of this these items that I can't the use. Heroes. It is where a variety of historically significant them. relics can be displayed. Yes. And it's quite a striking entrance to the museum, if I do say so myself. Off to the right is the reception hall and staff barracks, as well as the museum office where I do much of my work. Your mouth to our left, you'll find the central hallway leading to all the other galleries of the museum, which also serves as the cultural arts exhibit. Here, I hope to display a variety of art, as well as elements representing the more primitive cultures here in Skyrim, such as the Falmer, Forsworn, the Giants... There's that hammer that we just got. Down here on the lower level, you will find access to the East Exhibit Halls, which houses the Daedric Gallery, the Hall of Lost Empires, Hall of Oddities, and the Hall of Legends, which showcase a vast array of relics pertaining to the Daedra, Dwemer, Fulmer, and ancient Nordic cultures, as well as a number of peculiar items that defy simple classification. At the close end of this hall, the stairwell will lead to the armories in the basement and up to the second floor. There, you will find access to the Natural Science Gallery, as well as the Dragonborn Hall, where I will commission a variety of displays heralding any of your accomplishments. At the far end of the hallway, on the floor, you'll with find them. Sorry, access guys. to the Grand Library. And Everything else is running floor, okay. The door on the right I don't like also derpy. Right? To the museum oh, I kind of do. <laughs> if you cannot find me in my office, you will almost certainly find me whiling away the hours in the library. Also, you should pick up a copy of the museum guide at the entrance of the museum. It will let you know the schedule of where I'm working, should you need to find me. And it will offer you an easier way of navigating the museum, as well as keep track of how many displays our museum has. Of course, it may take me a moment to update those accounts, so check the guide again if you feel the numbers seem off. I'm sure I'll eventually account for everything. Any items you find for display, you can either manually place them yourself, or utilize the prep station in my office. And I'll ensure everything you have gets properly there. displayed if it has an appropriate place. I'm likely to have a variety of tasks for you, but in between, I'm sure you could help me find a random relic or two I've been researching. Feel free to look around and come find me if you have any questions. I'm very excited about the prospects of where we are headed. First off, here. You're back. Wonderful. What's next? Very simple. You keep doing what you're doing and stop in here from time to time if you find anything interesting. Have a look around and find the spot to display it. In addition to displaying the spoils of your adventures, 
suggests I will commission and build exhibits based on those exploits. Anything of relevant consequence can be inspiring to the people. Okay, we're... I know where to well, put this the place. Daedric, I, and the whole of I the really armory. just want if you a quest from you. And... Anything new? Oh yes, I have in fact been researching the location of an artifact of interest. If you have the time, you could investigate it. Glenmoral. I'll mark the location on your map. Let me know if you uncover it. Farewell. Glenmoral. Isn't that Glenmory? Like, the quest mod? I've never done that. Okay, um, let me do some things real quick. So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to run up here. I'm going to grab the book, like, guide thing. And I'm going to sort everything. So, I will see you guys just in a minute. And for those that don't know, basically all you do, you come over here. You do display prep, and then you do that, and press yes, and then it sorts everything for you over a period of time. But I'm going to get with Lucian first, and get all his stuff, and get rid of our inventories. Ah, I'm glad you're here. I've come oh. across a rare discovery in I got word of a unique relic, and was able to procure it from the cellar. Oh, okay. Use it if you wish, or place it on display. What is it? What did you give me? Skull Crusher. Hey, Lucian. What do you need? <laughs> oh, please, give me all the good stuff. Oh, I will literally give you all the stuff. There you go, Skull Crusher. Let's get back to it. That's all you, man. Um, there is one more thing that I want to do before we end this episode, guys. First off, I just want to point out that at the bottom right, I did notice that it says activate windows again. Um, if there's a better way to do it, um, basically, I've been opening the... Uh, um, what's it called the, the uh, reg registry editor something like that and I've been doing it that way and restarting my computer and it goes away but it seems that it comes back after a while and I'm still trying to figure out a fix for that unfortunately I've not yet done that so I'm gonna try to find the side of this I don't know if this is it or not Kind of seems like it. What is this? What in the world? Oh. Wait, what? Well, there ain't no telling. Wait, is this part of the Dragonborn thing? Okay. Guys, I'll see you in just a second. Well, guys, I was gonna try to get to the Khajiit that speak, uh basically like give me ruined books and I'll make new spells and scrolls and books and artifacts and stuff but I cannot find him uh, I did find some doors outside but they're locked so I'm not sure if I have to progress further in the story we do have 130 items so far that are on display so we'll just keep picking up and keep on bringing them back to the museum once we hit 200 I believe it's two four six eight like every 200 or so you unlock a, a thing um, I just progressively going on. Maybe it's not quite 200, but I do distinctly remember, I believe, 400 being Grim Sever. And as soon as we get that, Lucian is getting it, and he's going to be strong. Um, but uh, as always, guys, thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video. Like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoy it. I'm sure enjoying myself with this and this country kind of... Uh, I mean, let's face it, it's, it's a pure mage with accessories. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm having a blast with it. Um, don't forget, guys, we do have a new mini-series coming out October 3rd. Uh, so mark your calendars for that. Check out the Aldenari series if you haven't already. Join the Discord. And if you want to play Elysium, I do have a Wombajack video. I'm sure that most of you are aware and you can actually watch. And I walk you through on how to install my list with Wombajack. And that includes Elysium on how you do it. So with all that being said, guys, it's been a blast. This is Frexus, and I'll see you guys later.